VirtualBox has shortcut keys and they work an awful lot like macros do in Windows. If I go up to where it says File and Preferences and then I click on Input, there is a list of all of my shortcut keys including the commands that they actually are linked to. So for instance, if I look at F1, it's going to go to the contents, so it's going to show me the help sections and setup and that kind of thing. So if I click Cancel and then press F1, we see there is our user manual that pops up so we can get help during setup or troubleshooting. I'm going to go back to Preferences again and Input. And what I can also do is I can click inside any one of these commands and go to where it says Shortcut, and I can type any other key combination. So for instance, if I hold down the Alt key plus the number 1, I get Alt plus 1 will bring the About VirtualBox information. If I change my mind on that, I can click Reset and it'll go away, which is this arrow that's a half circle with pointing down. I'm going to go back and add that back in again. And now I have the option to where it says Unset Shortcuts. That just removes it. So the first one will bring it back to whatever the default is. So for instance, if I go into this Control-Shift-A for Cloud Profile Manager, let's say I switch to just using the Delete key only. And I change my mind. I want to go back to the original command. Well, I'll just click this Reset, and it takes me back to the original command. So if there was nothing there, it'll just erase it. If there was something there, it'll bring it back to where it was. And if, again, if I want to erase it, I can just click the Unset, and it goes away, or the Reset. And then when I'm done, I can click OK, and then I can go ahead and use those new shortcuts or the changes to shortcuts.